We begin tonight in Trenton, where a community continues to mourn the loss of four children killed in a house fire. KNBC 9's Eli Rosenberg is live from Trenton with the latest. Well, guys, still a lot of sadness here at the site of that fatal fire yesterday morning. Family members continue to gather, including over my left shoulder here. And New this afternoon, we have a vigil memorial that has come at the site of this family members coming, paying their respects. This fire started early yesterday morning and quickly spread on the second floor. Anna, age seven, Landy, six, and two boys, Mason and Salem, just three years old, were all asleep on that second floor. Family members say the father of three of those who died continues to be overcome with guilt, even though he risked his own life to try and save those four children. It was too late, couldn't get up the stairs. TJ tried to go up the stairs, he, could, he fell in. And then he got out and went up on the roof and he hollered for him, no answer. Like it breaks my heart really bad. Now back here live, additional family members are expected to show up as the evening goes on. Still trying to cope with the disaster that occurred here yesterday morning as the smell of smoke still lingers in the air. Live in Trenton, Eli Rosenberg, KNBC 9 News.